Well, uh, the studio at Living Opportunities uh, uh, has an event every year called Fern Archer. And uh, Dan Mish, who is the artist over there, hand painted this and it was on, uh, it was in an auction. And I am a big, big Beatle fan. And I saw that and said, I've got to have that. And so I bid on it. And uh, this was in October. Um, I won the bid very proudly, brought it back to my office and displayed it here. And then uh, the middle of November, uh, unfortunately, uh, someone broke into the office and uh, absconded with it. Fortunately, the folks next door at Four Daughters uh, had a video and he graciously, the general manager graciously uh, looked at the video and saw the, the thief um, bring it out and recover his bicycle, which was next to them and rode off into the sunset. That's the last I saw of it until this morning. So this morning, Detective uh, Tony Young from MPD called and said I had good news about the guitar. And he said uh, a patrol officer was, uh, and I'm assuming over the weekend, saw it in an alley on Oakdale and called in to ask if there was anything out on it. And of course um, there was. And so he picked it up and uh, it's, in, it's in great shape. Uh, got a broken string on it. So someone was playing it and enjoying it uh, at least for a little while. But it's back now, and I'm so happy. I never thought I would see it again, but uh, it's back. So um, a shout-out to MPD and uh, Tony Young. Um, it's great.